Sunday School Musical? More like Monday School Musical. Oh my god, this movie sucks. This movie is a ripoff of High School Musical. One of my favorite movies on Disney Channel. And this movie is a mockbuster and a parody version of High School Musical. Now, here are the reasons why this movie sucks in my opinion. For starters, it's a blatant ripoff of High School Musical, and the DVD cover alone is enough to drive home the message that it was made solely to cash in on it. The audio is constantly bouncing up and down. Like, one minute, the characters are talking in low voices, the next, the sound quality has suddenly shot up for no apparent reason. The songs often come off as annoying and downright irritating to listen to. Unlikable characters who, no matter the situation, always must have a reason to yell and get mad at each other. For example, when everyone discovered Zachary was moving, and not even that far away, they get angry and start yelling at him, even though it's in no way his fault that his mother lost her job and the family has to move. Another example would be Savannah yelling at her father for not understanding what she's going through. Speaking about that, Zachary wasn't even moving that far away, but he treats it like it's a big deal and he'll never be able to see anyone in his community again. False advertising, you see those green jackets the characters are wearing in the poster? Yeah, they never actually wear them in the movie. On top of that, the title is also misleading. Despite being called Sunday School Musical, it doesn't actually take place in a, presumed but unidentified Protestant, Sunday School. It takes place in a regular school throughout the majority of the film. There's no introduction or opening act, and the movie just immediately bombards you with the song without giving you any insight into the plot. The movie literally instantly kicks off with the main character singing about dreams by singing the same phrase over and over again which can get pretty annoying after a while. The movie has an entire five minutes dedicated to Savannah simply studying, aka being filler, and literally nothing else. No character, plot development, no heartwarming moments, nothing funny, or literally anything else happens in those five minutes of her studying. It's just, Savannah studying, and that's it for a solid five minutes. The editing is hilariously awful. In one scene, Zack starts inexplicably doing things in the bathroom like breathing loudly and swings from the toilet stall, for absolutely no reason. All of a sudden, the plot turns the gang performing to raise enough money to save their church that was going broke and was also never mentioned once before in the film. In one minute, they've been disqualified, the next, they're performing. The worst part? And they don't even get the money in the end. Another group won it and they just let them have it and don't even seem to care that didn't get the money to save their church. And while we're on the subject, random plot beats are just randomly thrown in with no build-up, like Savannah's mother's death, and Zack's father suddenly returning from the military at the end, the latter of which most likely being inserted to make a happy ending. And that's how the movie is. I don't know who likes or hates this movie, so I'm gonna leave it be. So screw Sunday School Musical. And screw the true story of Puss in Boots. Sean the Sheep movie is 966,000 times better than Sunday School Musical. End of rant.